Hello and welcome to the Gary Stewart Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm Greg Royce, joined by Stevenson Headman's basketball coach Gary Stewart. Coach, you um, had a couple of Mac Commonwealth games last week. Um, can I take a sue first? You went to Hood on Wednesday night, short trip down uh, I-70 to um, you know, play your in-state rival. And fortunately, fell a little bit hole early and were able to catch up once, but um, ultimately they um, got the best of you. Can I take us through that game a little bit? Yep, Hood uh, got off to a great start and uh, had great energy and and um, I thought we uh, we uh, showed some composure, worked ourselves back in the game, uh, got some stops. Uh, we were much more assertive in the second half. And um, to our credit, uh, being on the road and, and having a double-digit deficit, uh, we worked it into a manageable number and, ha- and had a chance to uh, to win the game. Uh, coming down the stretch, we just didn't close the game out very well. Yeah, uh, it seems like so many of these conference games, and we've talked about it all season, just come down to two or three plays right at the end. And um, you know, both both games last week, obviously the hood game and then the game at home against Arcadia on Saturday. You know, both teams made runs, and both teams, you know, it just comes down to who makes two or three plays right at the end. Yeah, uh, I looked uh, uh, this weekend, and every single game in conference has been a one, two, or three possession game. Uh, with the exception of uh, a one, and, um, and and we expected that yeah. in conference. I mean, it's it's a very um, um, close, competitive conference, and um, you know, it's a, a bounce of the ball that yeah. determines sometimes who wins and who loses. Yeah. Um. How do you talk to your team about that? I mean, obviously, you know, the results haven't been there the last couple of weeks like you like, but obviously, you've played well for certainly long stretches of games. Um, how do you keep them up, especially with such a young team, to, hey, just keep doing what we're doing, maybe be a little more consistent, and the results will come? Well, the frustration comes in um, being uh, close enough that you can reach out and touch it, but yeah. but haven't had the success that we want. Um, on the other end, um, if we were losing games uh, by 15 or 20 points, um, there's a lot of issues there. Yeah. Um, for us, um, we, we have uh, things that we think we control, things we think we can improve on. Um, so uh, from that perspective, from a coaching perspective, it's a, uh, um, a challenge to try to find those things and shore up those things in such a short amount of time. Yeah, yeah. obviously you've got a couple of days you know, to prepare for your next game. You're at Lebanon Valley on – Wednesday night, then you come back home again Saturday, third Saturday home in a row. You, put, um, you host Albright. You know, two of the teams that are certainly in the mix towards the top of the standings and two games that obviously, you know, the first time around you beat Lebanon Valley home and Albright, again, one of those one or two possession games up there. Yeah, yep. Um, it, it, there are no easy nights. Yeah. And uh, it's it, from a competitive standpoint, I love that. I love the fact that uh, every Wednesday and every Saturday um, you are in a battle, and, and, um, and it, gets, uh, it gives us an opportunity to um, um, test what we're trying to do against an opponent, and we're seeing different things. You yeah. know, somebody presents a zone, someone presents full court pressure. Um, somebody's very, very good on the interior or um, a very good perimeter player. So uh, we certainly have our work cut out for us this week and i um, looking forward to it. Yeah. All right, Coach, we wish you the best of luck. We'll see you certainly here at Owens Village Gymnasium on Saturday afternoon. Thank and, you, Greg. And once again, as always, we thank you for your time. For Gary Stewart, I'm Greg Royce. This has been the Gary Stewart Show.